last year, halfway through the year, they made the switch, made DeEric the permanent quarterback, and they have not looked back. Bryson Smith is actually in the backfield alongside King, who's going to fake it to Smith and swing it out to Stevenson for a nice first down. And targeting penalty in their last game of the second half. He's got to sit out the first half tonight. King on the move, tries to get away, does initially. He's not going to get away from this storm, and the Tulane defense comes up. Pressure here coming off the right side. One of those guys, Carlos Hatcher. He's a true freshman there. You're going to see he gets upfield, continues on the play. He's going to end up bringing down King there. But he's played really well the last few weeks. Confident group coming into this against a guy who's accounted for more touchdowns than any player in college football. Number four, De'Ara King. Play fake on first down. He's going to throw it deep. Stevenson down the middle and some contact there. Here comes a penalty flag. Pull to try to help speed up the tempo on second down and long. King pressured again. King very elusive but not elusive enough. That's the second Tulane. And trying to take a shot downfield. Devon Wright from the outside brings the initial pressure and then Tulane does a great job. It's good contain. They're getting after him. Two sacks already, third and very long, third and 24. King's going to step up, throw short, and out of the open field. Bryson Smith got away from one, not a second. Well, played out a little differently than last year. That win streak, of course, carries over from last year when they did not lose a game. De'Aaron King keeps it on first down for Houston. How do you assess the Knights of Houston? As many of those as I can if I'm a quarterback. He thought about doing it again. Instead, this is a keeper for King. And King breaks a tackle to the outside. First down, Houston. Stevenson in motion. King looking middle and throws it there open. And a completion to the tight end, Romello. Booker, Brooker wanted to keep going. King sat him down in the zone. Toward the end zone, and it is caught. No. Knocked away. Ball before the ball snap. Second and two. King looked like a design keeper. King goes down. He lost it. For how decimated they've been with injuries and no Patrick Johnson, they're playing really well to start this game. King keeps this one. He'll get the first down and much more to midfield. There goes Sierra King down the sideline with the speed. The quarterback inside the 10 to the 64 yards. He's got 13 rushing touchdowns. He's going to get a passing incompletion. We actually saw Cliff Kingsbury earlier this season on a Thursday night, of course, Patrick Mahomes college coach. And one of the things that he said, guys, was that the benefit are more comfortable, but he said either way, Jordan, Mahomes was going to be talented in any offense. Yeah, but Andy Reid and Sean McVay, both those head coaches, two of the most creative guys in the heck of a play. Second and one, Cougars come up with the turnover. After they went for it on fourth down, didn't get a kind of a second chance here. King dancing around, and King will heave it toward the end zone, incomplete. Kept the so first and ten, a quick snap. King throws to the tight end. Nice catch. That was not an easy catch for Romello Brooker. Since this run game is averaging just under 230 every week. King play fake. Flips it short, and there is the big tight end. Touchdown! This Houston team. Patrick Carr, the tailback. Nine carries, 90 yards, two touchdowns in this first half. Houston on the move again. First down, Cougars. They will hand it off. No, it's King who keeps it, and King gets a nice gain of four on first down. Just part of how they get Bryson Smith out there. King, play fake. Will throw, and he's got a man open. First down. Inside the good job twice now we've seen really good job by the receiver sitting down in his own finding that soft spot when Tulane does go his own coverage and making him pay King throws and a contested ball almost intercepted didn't happen yeah and one of the things I've noticed watching film is I think Houston could really improve on their second reaction plays these receivers understanding what to see if they go to him on this third down. They substituted, so the officials gave Tulane time to substitute themselves on defense. Throw across the middle and a missed tackle. That's going to be a Houston first down. It'll be first and goal. And they got first and goal from the three. Yeah, it would have been third and goal from the six. King keeper, King to the line of scrimmage. No more. Tulane's trying to get lined up here. They snap it to King, and King keeps it. De'Ara King, and another touchdown to his total. 
And he slips on that concrete. They want to take up as much time as they can. If Tulane's not going to use their timeouts, why not? And off to Carr. Patrick Carr still going down to the one. And I don't, I don't know why Tulane didn't use their timeouts. You can imagine this is really hard for Kendall Bryles. He's a guy that wants to call plays as quickly as possible. But this is the situation they wanted. They wanted to get up in this game, play with the lead, so they could actually slow the tempo down and give their defense, who's had more snaps than any team in the country, a little bit of a breather. You know, Houston may call a timeout here. At the end of that play, De'Ara King, who didn't even yeah. run on that play, he was limping, and he's coming to the sideline. They are going to use a timeout. You can see, takes the snap. I mean, that, that, right there. Yeah. Uh, and that, that makes you worried. It makes